understand see? what that leisure is. So you don't even know that yeah, I'm not totally. wearing real pants. You're going to whoosh, under the boob and then whoosh, over the shoulder. What's up you guys? Welcome back to Clever Style. It's Madeline, Drew, and Lauren, and today we are doing a fashion video for you guys. We're doing something different though. You know we like to try things here on this channel and we usually test sizing, but today we're gonna be our own stylist and style the trend faux leather leggings. Three different ways with pieces from our own closet. You guys, I'm so excited because the whole faux leather legging trend is everywhere. That's why it's a trend. Like so many vlogs, so many blogs, stores. And all of us have such unique style. Yeah. I'm like mm -hmm. excited to see what each of us are gonna kind of bring to these leggings and I feel like maybe they'll give you guys some inspiration for outfits. Maybe they'll give me some inspiration. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Me too. Same. Okay you guys, let's get to it. Let's go. All right, so our first category that we are styling is fall chic. So we are all wearing the same pair of faux leather leggings. They're from Nordstrom Rack. They are nice and high-waisted. I've never put on faux leather leggings before, so let me say it was a bit of a workout. <laughs> but here's what I really like. So I love wearing leggings. You can't always like dress up leggings and show off your booty because it just looks like you're wearing athletic leggings. Mm -hmm. This is nice because I'm still wearing leggings but I can like dress it up so you don't even know that yeah, I'm not totally. wearing real pants. You're going to a and I gotta say, I really love this. I'm a big fan of plaid. Clearly I'm not alone here. What do you mean? So here's what I did. I took this vest that I've had for a couple seasons and I just put like a simple black shirt underneath it and I dressed it up with these little boots. I feel like fall, but I also kind of feel a little trendy. I love the whole thing. You yeah. make me want cake and cookies and ice cocoa. Ice okay. cocoa? You're gonna be like the cool girl at a log cabin. <gasps> I've never you're been like the cool girl. chopping wood, but you're like slow motion about it. Yeah. You know what I mean? Oh, like yeah. Sexy lumberjack. Sexy lumberjack. Sexy lumberjack. Yeah. Do you look like Christmas? Yeah. I love all of these things I love. I feel like you could, I could wear this in a cabin. Yes. yes. Like, like making wall. a snowman. Jumping through leaves. Yeah. Oh my God, mm. I see the Insta picture. I would wear this to Target because that's all I do these days. Mm -hmm. You can't wear red to Target. People will think you work there and they'll ask you a million questions. Okay, I decided to pair my faux leather leggings with boots to disguise them. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I like the illusion that the legging goes into a shoe. Oh. You know? And then I also paired it with my little lumberjack plaid shirt that I got from Costco years ago. Wow. Perfect. Telling you, you can find it in the places that you don't expect. I usually wear the shirt not tied, and I just will wear it like without leggings with these boots because it comes down so low. But I like I wanted to show off the boot mm -hmm. legging range, you know. Yes. And then with this infinity scarf, I feel like I'm just ready to throw some leaves, like Lauren said, and drink some pumpkin spice lattes. <gasps> would you? I would totally. Yay! <laughs> I clown Lauren about drinking pumpkin spice lattes. <laughs> I feel like you look very like high fashion, trendy. That was generous. Thank I feel like, <laughs> true, this outfit would be like, I'm going over to a guy's house. I don't want to seem like I tried too hard. I've got my like loose baggy plaid shirt on. Right. I'm a comfy laid back girl, but look at my sexy yes, legs. Yes, yes. And Are then if you take going? off the boot, it's still a pleather legging like, all the way down. Can you imagine? You think I'm being sexy? You think I'm being sexy? Never ends. Nope, nope. <laughs> I would definitely wear this grocery store shopping, chilling on a Saturday morning. I just feel very casual and comfortable and cool. For my hair and makeup though, I didn't have time, but I would have put this in a bun just cause it's like mm -hmm. a lot going on just to get the hair out of the way. Um, makeup, it would probably look similar to this. I don't know if this lip is matching this, but it would be a little bit closer to that. If you were that grocery shopping, I mean, you'd have a hundred boyfriends. I definitely have People would be like, shopping. you look familiar. Are you on a TV show? <laughs> like something. I work at the yeah. North Pole. It's where you see me. <laughs> all right, guys, so I feel like we are all matching a little bit, but you know it's me because it's cropped. I'm always wearing something cropped. I don't know where this disease is coming from, but I can't <laughs> wear an outfit unless it has a crop top. I thrifted this turtleneck. Yes. Which is so That's genius. That. I never thought to crop a turtleneck. Me either. It just takes me and some scissors. Everything I own is cropped. It's not a joke. But I actually feel like it's working quite nicely with mm -hmm. these high-waisted leggings. I tried to be as cool as Drew with the, like, almost... You did it. You know, yeah. I buy so many hats and I never wear them. So this was like the perfect fall like little it. moment. Totally. My head yeah. is sweating, because we're in Los Angeles, <laughs> so I don't need it. But we're it's hot. cute, and it 
kind of matches. It totally yeah. matches. And Heather Gray, like gray to gray, I just feel like is the perfect fall. Yes. Little pop of color, we've all done it. Mm, love yeah, it. maybe I would do like a fun lip or um, like braids or something cool. Oh, oh braids. yeah, braids and yes. a beanie. Oh, yeah, so, so cute. cute. With like glasses that are fake and you're mm. just like, oh, <laughs> oh my vibes. God. This feels very um, New York. Like I would yeah. see you walking on your, like hurrying on your way to the subway. Right. Get out of my way, pedestrians. Right. Like I work, for, I work for Meryl Streep. Like, yeah, you yes. got coffees in your hand. Here's your Vogue. Yeah. yeah. That's a very Mary Kate Ashley Olsen situation. Going oh, on that's here. the best compliment I've yeah. ever received. God, I love it. Okay, I would wear this outfit um, to maybe run some errands on a cold day to meet like boyfriend's parents. You know what I mean? Like maybe just Ooh, yeah. a little sophisticated, mm. but she's fun and spunky. Very rom com. Oh my God, yes. stop. Mm -hmm. Okay, great. <laughs> All right, so this next look we have styled is for Girls' Night Out. Still wearing the same leggings. They are very moist. Ear, <sighs> earmuffs, Drew. I don't like They're it. They're moist on the inside. But Target is my thrifting, because this was like $7 at Target. Wow. It's like a, um, what is this, lizard? It's like snake? Alligator yeah, 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 snake. Yeah, like snake skin or Amphibian, uh -huh. right? Uh -huh. Reptile. Reptile. Okay, yep. reptile print tank top. I tied it because I like when high-waisted things like really cinch right yeah, in the waist. Yeah. So I feel like this is just very flattering on me. And then I paired it with these. These are snake for sure, right? Yeah, I mean, not real, snaky. obviously. I feel like there's a lot of faux-ness happening. Your earrings. But I like it. And then I got to wear, I don't really do a lot of adventurous earrings, but I like these big chunky black ones, which I feel pop with because of the leggings. I took a little risk, you know? I no, it ties this. it all together. Yeah. It's like so much fun. You kind of look like a secret oh agent in these pants too. Charlie's Angels. Good morning, Charlie. I'm comfortable in this outfit. I feel confident in this outfit, so I could wear this to a happy hour while the sun's still out, which is nice, and then transition into like a bar crawl. That's my girl's night out, mm -hmm. you know? Okay, for my g &O, I decided to go with a long blazer a uh, necklace and some boots and no shirt. <laughs> <laughs> what else are you wearing? Oh, and tape. They're taped. I don't recommend how I did it, but I did use duct tape. There was duct tape involved. It's whoosh, under the boob and then whoosh, over the Ooh. shoulder. But I, I, I love the idea of a blazer with no shirt on just because I feel like it's a mix of conservative with risky, you know? It's like a yes. power move. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. I feel like this could almost be like power red suits. carpet like statement, you, you know? know? Yeah. Or like you're the CEO of some company. Yeah. Oh, wow. I'd, I'd buy yeah. stock in it. Going yeah. into work that day. Yeah. You know? Good morning, ladies. I feel powerful in this. Mm -hmm. Yes. I feel like I can have a cocktail, but then also like F up some shiz later. You also could be fighting crime in this. Fighting crime. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And with the tape, a titty will not stray. <laughs> It's you very know. sophisticated and sexy. Thanks, and the all yeah. black is a, is such a move. I love that. Yeah. I think the only thing I would change, I like the maroon lip, but I think I would go for like a nude lip. Mm -hmm. You know, just cause like. You don't want to take the attention away exactly. from the important part. The leggings. Subdued. Yes. Ha, the leg no leggings. <laughs> this is my like Hannah Montana. Yes. Like I would wear this to a concert, I feel like. Yes. That's my girl's night out. I'm like going to go to the Jonas Brothers concert. Yes. I love it. I just did that. I'm trying to be like Lauren with the fun animal, fake animal print shoe. I thrifted these. Oh, like sure. Um, yes, I got these I at like it. Buffalo Exchange really cheap. This shirt is cropped. Did you what? buy it that what? way? You? I did, but I also washed it and it shrunk. So now it's like a baby tee. It's so cute though. And here's the joke. I'm super boring. So you have to just be like a little bit more obvious. And now I'm wild. You're, You're so not, not super boring. boring at all. Okay, and then these also <laughs> thrifted. These oh I feel God, like I look those. like Bono a little bit, but they're early 2000s. Like yes. pink. I love this. I want this to come back in style. Yeah. Like, Wait, I love this all is the colors. like 2002. That's what's going on oh, up I love here. It. You know what I mean? This is so. like Hilary Duff, Lizzie McGuire. That's how I feel. Right Best dress, here I come. Like these make everything actually like really fun, I'm noticing. Yeah. yeah. It kind of it like spices it up. Okay, this last category that we are styling is athleisure. Hey <laughs> I don't know why we've all like, like you said, had that reaction said. just now. Because what is athleisure? I think that's sure. there's such leisure. a gray area. Athletic wear worn leisurely. Yeah, sure. Comfortably. Yeah. yeah. So it's interesting trying to like casualify fancy faux leather leggings. Totally. So yeah. what I did is I put on. I love wearing my Converse with leggings in general, and then. I am wearing a Harry Potter sweatshirt. It's Leviosa, oh. not Leviosa. 
This is very comfy, very casual feeling, but I don't quite look like I could have slept in this because my pants are shiny. Mm -hmm. Totally. Maybe, mm -hmm. you know totally. what I mean? Mm -hmm. I probably have worn this outfit with regular leggings. I feel like you could even wear that to Disneyland or Harry Potter World. Mm -hmm. Like it's comfy, yeah. casual fall. Yeah. 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 But man, the leggings really do just add Amp like, it up. It like spice. a little punch. Yeah. Spice, yes. man. I'm a big fan, I would totally do the side braid. It feels very effortless. Probably wouldn't wear lipstick if I'm trying to look like maybe I could have gone to the gym, but I'm leisurely. Mm, mm. Is that what athletes are supposed to I don't understand what that leisure is. I thought I did. <laughs> I don't get it. Maybe it's just a way that we all can get away with wearing like gym clothes out in public. Yes. We're yeah. calling it athleisure. Honestly, I could wear this to the airport. This would be very comfortable mm. on a plane. I could run any errand in this without feeling overdressed. The leggings dress it up and everything else dresses it down. So it's like, which part do you want to focus on? Right. I uh, am not a very subdued person, clearly. <laughs> I went with a long oversized sweater and I paired it with this little shimmer shimmer belt um, and the same boots I had on before. And usually I would not pair this sparkly belt with faux leather leggings just because it's like a lot of flash. We found where Drew draws the line. We draw the line. <laughs> like that's too much sparkle for Drew? It's too much. Um, but I feel comfortable. Like I said, heels are an extension of my leg. Yeah. I just wear them all the time. I'm fake tall. It is what it is. I feel like this um, looks so cute on you. I love this sweatshirt. Isn't it fun? Yes. Yeah. I got this like, I forgot where I got this. New York City. I love this belt. I it, yeah. You rock it so well. Thanks. And it's like, I would never think to pair a belt with a sweatshirt, but it's like, it works. It's That's so fun. true. But I actually do want to know where you'd wear this. I would wear this to the store. Yeah, like Aaron's. <laughs> totally. Yeah. Like, you know, Saturday morning, so I need to get Shopping. some things from CVS, some Target. You it's, know? It's funny, you say you wouldn't normally pair the belt with it, but I feel like without the belt, it's not a Drew outfit. True. But with this belt, I like it because you could either wear it to the front or I also like it to like on the side. You know? <laughs> yeah. That's like Peter Pan. Yeah. <gasps> I feel like very like 80s, 90s. Yes. You know? I was gonna say you kind of give me like old school workout Ooh, vibes. Yeah. Like, like she's a maniac. Is that copyright? <laughs> not the way we're singing it. <laughs> and it's like, yes, this is not the typical casual athleisure, but it just goes to show that you can style these leggings in so many different ways, mm. you know? You can style athleisure in so many different ways. Yep. So many different ways. There's layers to this. <sighs> layers, onion. like onion, an onion, like mm -hmm. Shrek. You get it, we both have layers. Okay, so mine's probably the more like athlete to the leisure. Athle. I, Athle. I leaned into the athlete of the leisure. I wore this shirt yesterday, spilled some chocolate ice cream on it. Mm, nothing more athleisure than that. So it's like kind of like gym vibes. I do feel mm. like these dress up the gym vibe. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And same with like my hot lip happening. So like definitely didn't go to the gym in this. I did however wear like just some chill black tennis shoes because I felt like that was more cash mm -hmm. yeah. for me. Like, oh, just gonna go run to Target. Everything's to Target. Target. This is Target Sponsored by Target. <laughs> Target notice us. Um, and then I threw on this like little comfy knit sweater just in case it got cold for once in Los Angeles. I love it. Yeah. And it says Los Angeles on it. Got it from Brandy. It gives me very like 90s Princess Diana. Oh. oh. You know, cause she always had the She would do like, like the biker shorts yeah. and the oversized tee and like it would be like USA. Yeah. Yes, I love that. Royalty. All respect. I'm just the 90s. 90s, the 2000s. It's all going to come so out. You. Yeah. But I liked the color. I liked that it was kind of like a vintage gym tee. Yeah. And these definitely make it a little bit more fancy. I think in my normal day to day, I wouldn't do the fancy leggings with this. But I kind of like that it's, I don't know, she's day to night. Again, throw on some heels. Yeah. And I'm like, it's intentionally 80s or something. I could wear this to Disneyland. Yeah. I could wear this to Disneyland. Oh, yeah. Somewhere outside, somewhere fun and sporty. Okay, now you've seen how we style these faux leather leggings three different ways, three different times. So we're going to go and pick our favorites and come back out. All right, so these are the looks the favorite looks that we chose and we styled with our faux leather leggings. <sighs> Why did you choose this, Drew? I feel comfortable, but I also feel very me, you know? It's just so bendy. Very cute and fun. <laughs> Thanks. I went with the Girls Night Out look because I just felt like it was something really different and unique and really girly and party. I don't know. She's going mm -hmm. to a concert. So yeah. cute. Yeah. What about you? Um, mm -hmm. I went with the athleisure because it feels like it is elevated something I already wear. Yeah. yeah. The leggings have really like spiced it up. So that's why I did that. <sighs> you guys, you can see style different things so many different ways. We did it with our own closets. Yeah. We're proof that you can too yeah. at home. And send us photos of you guys maybe trying some leggings, how you guys are styling we them. We need ideas. Because I'm curious, yeah, I want ideas too. Yeah, all and the ideas. We're gonna link all of these leggings and even some different kinds of leggings so you guys can try Production. below. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, yeah, mm -hmm. I think it's really cool that we like not only did the trend 
in our own way, but like three different, nine ways. I know, Tons nine different ways. ways. Yeah. And if you like this type of show that we are trying, let us know what other trends other we should bring our closets to. Please subscribe, hit that bell so you never miss a notification when we post and come back. We have more style videos, so click over here to keep checking them out, okay? Uh -huh, uh -huh. Let's go. What do you do with your chin? What do you do with your chin? <laughs> with your chin?